Yesterday we released Oracle SQL Developer version 4.0.2, which is our second patch for the 4.0 release, which initially came out in December of 2013. And it represents another set of bug fixes. However, we did tweak one feature that I wanted to give a quick shout out to, and that's our Code Insight feature. And when you hear Code Insight, you'll generally think think of things like this where I'm typing and the tool will attempt to help me out. So here is a list of objects I can select from. And if I select one of these I can then come up to the asterisk column list and say you know what what list of columns do I want. So that's the, the feature in a nutshell. How we tweaked it is if you go to the preferences, you'll notice a few things. The pop-up speed now defaults to 0 0.6 seconds. So when it's automatic is enabled, so where the advice pops up um, without you doing anything, um, it takes a little bit more than a half second now of not typing for that feature to invoke. And also, we are not popping up the select list unless there are um, 10 or fewer matches. So we're trying to increase the likelihood that the advice is going to be helpful. So let's say I want to write uh, select star from Scott dot half second bam four entries. So that's less than ten entries, so that automatically comes up without me doing anything. Let's do a much larger result set. If I were to say just select star from sys dot, wait half second, nothing, nothing. Okay, so that's the automatic bit of the feature being suppressed based on that new uh, preference to say uh, wait until I have fewer than ten hits. So if I were to type something uh, a little bit less or more restrictive, so that automatically did come up. If I want to force the Insight feature to come up without uh, waiting the period of time or without uh, getting the 10 or fewer hits, I can use the keyboard. So if I hit Control Space Bar, that forces the list up. Um, so another small tweak that we made was in the UI of this, we force the pop-up list to occupy a, a certain amount of space in the screen so it'll never cover the entire editor and also if you were to do this over here for some weird reason we'll pop up the list as much as we can under the cursor so let's talk about the preferences again one more time so under uh, tools preferences code editor and then on the completion insight page uh, the pop-up speed uh, for the automatic help is uh, set to kick in after uh, six tenths of a second and we will not do that if there are more than ten hits so you can increase that or uh, if you want to be completely in control you can disable the automatic bits it will never automatically pop up and it will only pop up when you ask it to using the keyboard keep using the keyboard which is control space